Okay, girls, you're very welcome to Destination Yuri here this evening. Caroline, Mags, Cloda, and Sinead. Pretty ladies in pink, but it's not going to be that pretty on the 7th of October. You're going to the All Ireland, hoping to win the All Ireland. Caroline, what do you think? Yep. <laughs> oh no, we're very confident going into the match. Uh, we've played Waterford before this year, and we know that they're going to be very, very tough. Um, we've an extra week now to get in a few extra training sessions, so we're confident that we can do the business. Mags, you're the captain this year, and you've been there before, done it, back in Crow Park. What does it feel like? It's great to get back to Crow Park after six years. You know, we've trained hard all year, and we knew at the start of the year this was the goal we were going for, so everybody's buzzing and can't wait to get back. And Chloe, yourself, you were yeah. involved before, we're back to Crow Park. What does it feel like? Yeah, it's just great. It's a great buzz to train on Hall and um, something to look forward to. Um, just everyone's training away. Even the hype outside has been brilliant, the support now I'm getting. So just really, really looking forward to it. And Sinead, you're very pensive standing there. Again, <laughs> heading to Crew Park, running out in Crew Park. It's going to be a little bit special. Yeah, it's a brilliant achievement for us to get there this year. Um, it's where every footballer wants to be. From You started under age, it's your dream to get running out in Crook Park on all Island final there. So just can't wait the extra week now. I think everybody was just disappointed more so that we wanted the game to be this weekend, never mind an extra week. So, um, But it's, as Caroline says, we have to take the positive from it and it's an extra week's training and hopefully we can build on that and push on now. And girls, of course, all the, the crack about the match being put back a week, the way you're looking at it, it's another week's training. More preparation. And next week to enjoy the build up as well. Enjoy visit we're a few schools today and just enjoy the, the build up to the game because um, before you know it it's over and we spend the next couple of years talking about it. So. And of course Caroline, six years, Mag, six years is a long, long time ago. I know you think that that's we thought at that stage that it happened every year because we we're two in a row, but um, as you say it's a long time ago now. And of course girls the seventh of October. Is your heading to Crow Park? Yep. Wearing the orange of our ma. Um, not the pink, not the pink. <laughs> no, and wh what's the reason for the pink? It's just a good answer, Caroline. It's going to be more girly. <laughs> more girly. Okay, and girls, on behalf of Destination Yuri, we'll follow you, we'll watch you, and we hope you bring back Thank the All-Ireland. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. James Daly, our man manager. James, last year you took the minors to the All-Ireland All final. This, this time around you're with the girls and you're in the intermediate final. James, you have a big act to follow. Uh, I'm just happy to be there, Damien. Uh, the girls have worked hard all year, and I give all the credit to the girls. I, like I was with the minors last year. I had a great team last year, and I'm a, I'm a firm believer in you know a manager when the win gets too much credit and when they lose they get too much to blame. But just delighted to be there, Damien. Girls have worked really, really hard all year, and deserve to be in an All Ireland final. And James, you have a lot of experienced players and a lot of youth as well. Yeah, we have. We've, we have a great sprinkling of players. I think we have nine of last year's minor panel uh, who've, who've contributed right throughout the league. Uh, you know, even my daughter Katie stepped in last in the semi-final when Catherine was injured and and had a great game. Okay, we have Fanula McKenna, Neve Henderson, Kira Lennon, Shauna Gray. Girls have all contributed. Siobhan Mackel came off the bench and, and contributed her part. All good girls and, and you know, you know, dying to get on to the pitch there for our man. And James, of course, the game was moved to the 7th of October. Gives you another week's training, another bit of preparation. Yeah, but it's, 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 that's the way we put it down. We're, a bit more time to plan, a bit more time to prepare, get, get different things in order, work on things a wee bit more. And, you know, the, the girls were all very, very positive. But I was really annoyed for the first hour. And, uh, but after that, I caught myself on and still, I'm still in All-Ireland final. And that, that's what it's all about. And they moved it back a week. You know, if one of the, as one of the girls said to me, if they had moved it to Hong Kong, we would have went and played it in Hong Kong. So, James, I probably wish it wasn't Hong Kong. It would have been a good trip. Oh, it would be nice. <laughs> right. But yeah, of course, well. of course, James, it's all to be done on the seventh of October at two o'clock in Crow Park. Yeah, well, like Waterford are, are an excellent team. We played them twice. They know us. We know them. It's 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 going to be what how they can improve and what we done the last time. We need to look at the, where they were stronger than us the last day. And we played them in Kalevi uh, in the first game of the Championship Series. 
and we had a draw and we were lucky to get out of there with a draw we came in and we played them in Dublin we played a super game of football that night and I, I really believe that night we would have beat most teams in Ireland that night we were really really good but in saying that we let Waterford come back at us in the second half and that's something we have to work on and we have worked at it in training the girls have worked really 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 hard all year I think I was just checking the other day I think we done our 100 and second session there the other night and the girls are buzzing you know so they they don't care what we work on as long as you know everything, everything's good everything's positive well James on behalf of Destination Uri we wish you well and we will be supporting you on the 7th of October and I hope to be there Damien thank you very much and appreciate it